hello and welcome today's day out is going to be across the border in Wales so I have my passport and uh, we are in Wales, South Wales and we're in Caerphilly so I'm not going to make any cheesy puns and, and I'm not going to make any references to being very careful and driving carefully around the town because that would be silly wasn't it uh, but yes I am going to be very carefully having a look round the castle is directly ahead of me I've had to come into the main car park here which is just off for the town's town area the town is on top of a hill um, but I'm parking in the public car park and it's a disabled bay however Disabled badge holders are required to pay, but can have an extra hour free. So I just paid £1.20, however I didn't have any change, so they've got £1.50 out of me. Uh, I think that's a bit of a scam myself. Wait a minute, this could be some kind of scam, or possibly scam all of There you go, that's somebody else has just had the same problem as me. They paid £1.50 because they haven't got any change. Allegedly, from my research, the uh, entry fee is about six pounds, uh, and people have been leaving TripAdvisor um, reviews about it. So that's the town over there. We're going to try and probably a, there's a little sort of arcade thing over there. We'll have a look at later on. But this is all about the castle at the moment. So Caerphilly Castle. Oh, maybe it's not the entrance. Or is it? Yes, it is. I have no idea. Looks a bit cobbly to me. Hmm. Get ready for a, a bumpy ride. Good job I got suspension. So I hope the rain holds off because it's going to be a horrible if it's, um, it's raining it's not really warm either it's like maybe nine degrees so let's have a look at the, the entrance way yeah so quite formidable so this is uh being very careful to go in here this is uh Kerfilly Castle in Portcullis so we can have a little look at All right, so it's uh all right okay so there's the um, process there so reduced rate adult uh, which I presume is what I will get £5.20 I have to say, I have been here before, and I haven't been here for donkey's years. So it's uh, going to be an experience. Now, which door is it? Is there a automatic door? Oh, it's not automatic. Sorry, you yeah, haven't got one. Not, no, no it, well, it's manual. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Yes, please. Is it? No oh, there's no admission fee. Oh, right. So what did the what did the uh, rate say? What did they refer to? Oh, it's because you restricted access. And oh, that's okay. So, so anybody in a wheelchair yeah. would would not pay. No. Oh, right. Okay. That's and you can bring someone with you. As well. And you can bring someone. That's really good. Well done. That's excellent. So where am I going? Go this way. Thank you very much. Yeah, lovely. Oh, that's good. So I don't know where to start first. I think we'll probably go up the hill. Get an impressive uh, view of the castle. Yeah. It's pretty good. Wow. 
So storming of the castle. Uh, see the moat. There's a quite a deep moat. It was um, refilled. Um, obviously, when they were doing the restoration for the. Um, Wow, that's uh, impressive. Of course, there's a little bit of a tower over to my left, which is uh, slightly damaged. down by the look of it. And the um, buttons. So it's been here for uh, quite a few years. And there is a bit of a, bit of a steep um, steep incline here. So yeah, it's sort of good go around the edge and a grassy bit and what I'll do is I'll find a little um, thing we can look at or firing slot so we can have a look through there so you can imagine firing your arrows through that hole yeah can't see a lot. Then they've got a, like a statue thing holding up the um, holding up the tower, which is quite interesting. Quite good. Don't know if you can see that. So we're going on grass, but it's okay. It's not too bad. Edge as well, is it there? Just uh, got to take it steady going over that. So, ah. now, I'm presuming that you can if you able. You can go in there, and there's um, a door in and some steps up. And you could go in there in a little bit of an exhibition place. So you go up in the tower, and there's another one, another one on that side. So you could go in there. East Gate House. Some toilets over here. There's a yeah, sort of a, a sort of a walkway um, going around the edge of the tower, um, the uh, wall, which you can obviously be able and you can walk around. And in the castle, oh, there's, um, there's a well, but there's a um, great hall. So we might have a look. Have a look in the Great Hall. So. Wow. Wow. Wow, wow. Right, I'll do a 360, I think. Do a 360. Wow. Cool. 
of the fireplace. You can just imagine that. And a banquet in here. Sort of a projected image on that. Table. Another little courtyard thing, and then there is a doorway there with steps go up into the into the walkway tower. But that should this is probably the original um, stairway. So you can't get out that way. You have to go back through the main hall. been here before but not for a long long time. Now there looks like there's something down that way but I don't think we can go down because there is steps but it looks like there's a mirror of some sort. It's all linked together with the uh, so we can't go down this way either because there's steps. Yeah so that's no link no uh, and this looks like the back of the castle anyway. So there's a ruin. And then, so there's another exhibition over here. But whether I can get off the, uh, there is a very big ledge. Um, and it goes all the way down. So whether I can get off this, it's okay getting off, but I can't, won't be able to get back on. So now, but I think it probably be okay there. There is some um, steps down. And then there's the the walkway up the top. Mm, I don't know. No, I don't know, I'm getting stuck, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to go in there. But there is some some sort of exhibition, so There is a ledge and it's really annoying. That wouldn't really take very much. And I could go down into the exhibition. That's a bit annoying, but then I'm not paying, so you know you could argue that. But that's just, uh, yeah. Mm. A well, with the well going down, so they had the drinking water. Right, let's uh, head head back down. The 
across Wales is all about dragons as well. So there's a there is a dragon which I'll show you in a minute. Allegedly nesting. So they have the visitor centre. Disappointingly with no automatic door. Quite a large area. And we're going to come across this same problem with the, uh, the ledge here. So there's two, there's uh, the uh, ledge there and the, and the stonework, which is going to prevent me from going down there. Um, however, I don't know what's the other end, whether it's a ramp or whether it's steps. So accessing that other area is probably going to be difficult. Looks like there's some sort of um, stone throwing device over there. They chuck the stones over the wall. Ah, thank you very much. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. There's a uh, very good shot of the entire castle. 1957. Well, there we go. That's my day out. Being very careful around Kefili and the the castle behind me and very surprisingly it's free of charge for people in wheelchairs and disabled people and you know they even said you can bring somebody with you as well so but you will find that some of the accessibility is quite limited uh, so they were quite right about that that they're not they're not charging you uh, money um, because you can't get round the whole castle, which is, you know, okay by me. I enjoyed my day out, and I hope you did too. And uh, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like, and a share, and come back again very soon for another day out. Bye for now.